it is age old practice in pharma sales that managers go for a joint field work with the medical rep almost every month in last 5 6, six decades much has changed but this practice has not changed much we still follow almost the same rituals without even fully understanding objective of the same so today we are going to discuss about it what are the issues and what are the solutions first let's understand the objective of the joint field work for a first line manager to work with a medical rep there are four objectives one is on the job training to the medical rep second is supervision including implementation third is taking care of the major customers and fourth is as a line management communication with the medical reps when we look at from second line manager point of view he has got three major objectives for field work or joint field work one is taking care of kols and kbls second is development of team or medical reps or first line including first line managers and third is observation and understanding market conditions to develop regional strategies and deployment of resources these work by the first line manager need once in a month visit as he has to see the improvement over the last month primarily in the training part supervision part implementation part so until unless he does not give the sufficient gap he can't see the improvement except the fourth point where he has to see the communication part for second line manager once in a quarter is also sufficient looking into his objective you look at what objective second line manager has if he is visiting too frequently that is also waste so he, he can go in once in a quarter but we are observing for decades that first line manager are visiting territories for 5 to 6 days every month whether it's a 3 plus 3 or 3 plus 2 or 2 plus 2 plus 2 or something like this and sometimes if they even visit for a day same way second line manager also try to reach out every medical rep almost every month and this kind of working create four problems one is this increase uh, time waste in the traveling or increase the traveling cost secondly this duplicate subordinate work this way by too much visiting first line manager doing my job of medical rep and regional manager or second line manager doing a job of the first line manager which makes entire system less effective and less efficient and it does not allow subordinate to develop because they are seen as doing their job third problem is create is it's a very low span of control it increase cost of operation because of more managers and fourth problem is too frequent or too less visit by the manager lead to this reduce effectiveness as he is become over exposed and subordinate does not respect him much now in too much working together manager tend to open up to the subordinates and this begun a kind of hand in gloves kind of activities now we look back in the past why it started 3 plus 3 or 3 plus 2 system as i mentioned in the past in the beginning one objective used to be communication with the subordinate as 2 3 decade back there was not a system of mobile phone or internet so there was problem of communication now with the coming of mobile phone internet video conferencing the problem of communication is not there so that that so much frequent visits are not required so another aspect i want to talk about what is the current lot of leadership sometimes suggest on this current lot of leadership sometimes says that as to managers that you should visit territory continuously 5 6 days and meet 50 60 doctors and this is something which manager find uncomfortable and this is it just seems like a manager playing a medical rep role going and working for 6 days 8 days kind of thing and it does not make medical rep responsible because once his first line manager working so much in the field then he no longer is responsible as a medical rep in fact it leads to situation where we doubt medical rep now what solution most manager find in this situation in the changing situation most field manager they work most of time with the headquarter medical rep and visit out session for 2 3 days in a month and then they start beginning all the control system tracking system implementation issues and all the difference and fighting with the hierarchies so these all issues are creating more problem less of the solution so let's talk about the solution see sometime we need to cross over a bridge we cannot keep standing on one side of the bridge and keep fighting now the time has come to increase the span of control 
where in a company normal span of control is 3 to 5 this need to increase up to 6 to 8 and this will lead to four benefits the first benefit is this will improve effectiveness of entire system and proper delegation and development in the team second benefit is this will reduce operation cost as less number of manager will be required and third benefit is this will avoid unnecessary fighting and the negative work like tracking or too much control systems in the sales management process and fourth benefit is we can pay better now and make their role enriched which will reduce attrition so once we reduce number of you know managers we can increase the salaries we can you know increase uh, improve the role enrichment and this will reduce the attrition also but yes these changes will upset our current thought process where we treat first line manager as a medical rep but there is a time for every change now time has changed otherwise our cost of operation is going up and system effectiveness or efficiency is not improving so we need to think on these lines and have a revised thinking about how to deal with the joint field work of the manager with the medical rep